State Hospital, former WWF Heavyweight Champion, Morgan the Media! You know, I have gone to great lengths to see that Morgan the Media would come back here to the MEWF, but I've taken it a step further, Mike Nichols. Really? A little What'd bit later on, I have a surprise guest coming in to join us. Great. A psychiatrist who's going to tell us all about the rehabilitation of Morgus the Maniac. I wouldn't happen to know the psychiatrist, would I? He you may on reputation alone, if not personally, and I'm just going to tease you right now. I'm not going to give you any more information than that, you're but he'll be with us shortly. You're bringing in Dr. Ruth Westheimer, aren't you? I don't know if Morgus needs that kind of rehabilitation. We're not, we're not that friendly, as it were. <laughs> Ron Osborne can come out of here an easy victor if he just outthinks this moron. Well, obviously an impressive individual. Unlike the likes of Stud Lee, who is an unimpressive individual. Are you going to continue to poke fun at me, Nichols? Because I, I can get up and walk out of here and leave you stranded. I told you I didn't bring my poker tonight, and you're more than welcome to walk out any time you want to. Well, obviously, Osborne hasn't done his homework. A head to the turnbuckle is not going to phase Morgus the Maniac, the hardest head in the business, bar none. Now, watch this. Whack, whack, whack. This guy is an idiot. Hey, Mikey, he likes it. He likes it. What a simpleton. Morgus is definitely in the pain and inflicting pain on the likes of many a professional wrestler in the sport of wrestling. And the MEWF is no exception. I just want to know where this guy was when they handed out greens. He, right. he obviously got out of line. He was behind you. Yeah, well, I got the last one. And it was the size of a pea. Osborne shoots him off the ropes. Big elbow. Ugh. Oh, he's a powerhouse, obviously. You're not going to keep a good man like Morgus down by merely an elbow. Rearranging the facial features. Seems to be working up to this point. Morgus is just regrouping. Well, this kind of match is great for somebody like Morgus. His best attribute is his ability to withstand punishment. I, I even think he likes to be punished. Speaking and of punishment, we could say the same thing of corporal punishment. Don't you start on him. <laughs> Mysterious I, in his absence thus far. I think he'll you, be here. Don't you worry about that. He'll be here. I think you have been brainwashed by the likes of corporal punishment, Studley. Uh, I don't think so. Well, obviously, power is going to be Osborne's game, and he's going to have to try to try to wear Morgus down. Definitely. High impact maneuvers, things along that line. But that's what Morgus does best. He absorbs punishment. He takes the blows. I think that it could be a rope-a-dope and Osborne could wear himself out and Morgus come away with the victory. I'll tell you what, Ron, you're not a genius, but wouldn't you have to agree with, agree with me when I tell you the key to winning this match against Morgus is just plain out outthinking him? I mean, you know he's a simpleton. Look at him. No, I can't, I can't say I agree. The, the key to winning a match with, with Morgus the Maniac is surviving the match with Morgus the Maniac. And you got to understand that any great maniac has quite a devious mind. They're quite clever in is their execution. Is that how you got your mind, Mike? You're a maniac. I resemble that remark. I, I, think I, you're believe, just plain the term, dumb. I believe the term is party animal. Party animal, yeah. Yeah, I, I'm a party animal and Morgus is a maniac. Yeah, well, they should take this party next to me and put him in a cage where the animal belongs. Well, you should be where the buffalo roams, General Stuglis. Stick to the match, Nichols. Nice rear chin lock. Oh, that's it. Build up your endurance from these morons at ringside. Real intelligent, Morgus. Feeding off the fans. What an attitude. Series of elbows breaks him free. Now can he take advantage of it? He backs him off. Shoots the bad man out. Nice clothesline. But no effect. Osborne up in a hurry. A little bit too slow on that clothesline, wouldn't you say, Ron? Absolutely. A little sluggish. Obviously a little worse from the wear, from the onslaught so far from Osborne. Referee's got to break it here. Morg is not looking too well at this moment. Drop kick by the big man. I'm impressed. 
man's got great technical skills, doesn't he? As I say, I'm uh -huh. impressed. I'm not impressed by here. He's a little too slow, a little too methodical for my taste. It's almost as if someone gave Morgus his medication before he came out tonight. Scoops him up. Oh, nice slam. Into the corner. Up to the second rope from the inside. Perch is on. Could be wasting too much time here. Nobody home. Five minutes gone by. Five minutes gone by. Now. Speaking of a waste of time, if anybody would know about wasting time, General Stud Lee would know. First. You're right. Yeah. I'm wasting my time sitting next to you. Well, the clock is starting to tick, and it's just a matter of time before Morgus gets another shot at your man, Corporal Punishment. Never happened. Never oh, happened. I think I'll do everything so. in my power, Young, to keep him from getting back on top. I think Corporal Punishment could use a good beating from the likes of Morgus the Maniac. Yeah, well, I think you could use a good beating from Corporal Punishment. I was born with a series of headbutts. Well, I, uh, I'll go on with that. And yet another one. This time levels Osborne, shoots him off the ropes. Nice scoop power slam. In position for a cover, but he lets him off. Morgus gets up entirely too quick. He could have had the pinfall right there, don't you agree? I think he had his man down, and you're right. Now I he think Morgus is doing too, but too much showboating here. Uh huh. How'd that foot taste, you goofball? Probably not nearly as good as the foot that you keep in your mouth so often, Studley. The bad man obviously in control at this point. Clubbing forearm to the back, drives Morgus to the mat. I have to admit, I'm very impressed with Osborne so far. I didn't give him a chance in this match. I really didn't think that he could withstand five minutes of the onslaught from Morgus. But shock trauma. Slam. That's his finishing and move at shock maniac. trauma. He wins. That Time quickly. And you're proven wrong once again. Morgus. Morgus. Oh. <laughs>